everyone. Welcome to our daily demo. I have Matt Salazar here from EA here to show us My Sims Sky Heroes. Welcome. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. Okay, so tell us about My Sims Sky Heroes. So this is our action adventure game for the My Sims franchise. You know, My Sims has sort of been like EA's Muppets. Yeah. You know, a host of characters that we put into a bunch of different contexts, and this is our flying action game. Oh, it's very different from the previous games. Very different. You know, we wanted to have something where, uh, you know, folks could get in, have a lot of fun, shoot around, uh, pick up a lot of power-ups, that sort of thing. Just yeah, and I noticed this time it's on, like, the 360, the first time it's coming to the next generation. Right. This is the first time My Sims is coming out on the HD platforms, mm -hmm. in addition to Wii and NDS, of course. All right, cool. So let's jump in and see what we right. have here. Well, you know, any My Sims game, a big part of it is the customization. Mm -hmm. And, of course, you can edit your Sim, you can create uh, all sorts of different goofy characters. You can see I've got this goofy eye patch girl here going on. <laughs> but the big thing we wanted to focus on was the planes. Yeah. So we've got all these different planes that you can choose from. But what's really cool is you can mix and match all the parts. So here's this kind of plane that we've already made up. But I'll show you how we can change some of the parts. As you go through the game, you go mm -hmm. through story mode, you unlock different parts to uh, mix and match all over the place. So. I can change the whole plane body at once. So yeah. you can see kind of our archetype style. So nice. The bomber, the shark. The so it kind of affects like how well the plane steers speed and all that. Right. Well, you upgrade each plane has different stylized parts. So mm -hmm. this is like the max tier uh, guardian, and then it's like a max tier shadow, that sort of thing. Okay. So let's grab a lancer body here. But let's say I don't really like the wings. They're kind of like the little stubby wings there on the lancer. So I'm going to swap out those for... Let's see here. Renegade wings, pretty big. Ah, Horizon. <laughs> there we go. Got kind of these like wacky forward facing wings here. And let's say I want to change up the stuff down here on the bottom. Oh, look at those effects. <laughs> right. Oh, well, let's change the particle effects too. We can do that. So. You can also adjust the, uh, uh, customize your sim like in the previous games too. Right? Of course, of and course. familiar characters will be returning, I assume? They'll, you'll have all your favorite characters, Chaz and DJ Candy, and even a few uh, EA uh, cameo characters you might see in there. So, oh, yes. here we go. We've got some uh, rainbow disco oh, exhaust. Um, one of the things we also wanted to do is you really wanted to make this so you could not just customize the parts, but mm -hmm. also customize the look. Um, we have a lot of painting options. You can change kind of the whole color scheme all at once. Mm -hmm. So let's say I want a bright red plane here. But then you can take individual parts, let's say the wings, and we can, in two different tiers, change the coloring up. So I like red and green. So let's put a little yellow in there, a little accent. And there we go. And you can do that across all the different parts. All the parts have two times okay. to change. So definitely be yours. It'll definitely be yours. And what about the online options in the game? Like, are you the sharing? Um, or everyone gets to see your plane. Mm -hmm. So really, it's all about taking your plane in yeah, and you know, shooting up your friends. <laughs> so let's see, you get to pick your logo. All right, let's go ahead and save this bad boy. Back out. So how are the gameplay missions set up? Uh, the, game, the story mode is uh, about 40 plus missions. OK. And it tells us we've got this kind of born identity story going on. You're an amnesiac. You wake up on a, on a desert island, and you've got to get through to uh, uh, to try to save this guy from the evil Morcubus. He's kind of our Bowser uh, fellow. So let's do a dog fight. Dog fight. Great. So there's all these adjustments that you can... Right. All these different things you can do. Let's do a quick little dog fight here. And bunch of AI characters, and oh, I'm going to get my butt kicked, I'll put it up on hard. <laughs> All right. Make it exciting. Make it exciting. And a bunch of different characters to pick from. Oh, hey, there we go. Commander Shepard. <laughs> Where is he coming from? And let's see here, let's take one of my <laughs> creative planes, hop right in. These are perks that you get to pick up, so I like strong machine guns, I use those a lot. And we'll use... Now, you said there are like nine players, but then we're playing with AI right now. But how many actual people can play together? Uh, on the, sing the single system, you can do two players. Mm -hmm. uh, but online, up to ten on the HD consoles and mm -hmm. up to six on the Wii. Nice. We really wanted to make this a game that was easy for mm -hmm. older players to play with younger players. Yeah. And one of the things we did is that uh, the quick play modes have team modes. So you can have a team dogfight or a team race going on. Uh, you know, maybe dad comes in and plays for a little while and, you know, takes down nine enemies and mm -hmm. junior comes in and takes down one. 
but together they won. Okay. So, so it's not just a free for all. You can. So it's not just a free for all. Exactly. So here we are. This is Mount Smolder. This is one of my favorite levels here. <laughs> How do the controls work? Are they? Um, pretty straightforward. Left stick to move. Right stick does tricks. Mm -hmm. So let's do a little loopy loop. You know, barrel rolls. Got to do barrel rolls. And you do Immelman turns for quick 180s. Yeah. And no damage if you decide to fly right into a volcano. Sure. None at all, actually. That was one of the things. Uh, you know, we make this game accessible to younger players, but mm -hmm. still challenging. Um, and one of the things we wanted to do was that. Uh, we didn't want to minimize frustration so yeah. that little kids could pick it up. So you can just run right into walls all you want, that won't hurt, but there's plenty of other things to take you down. Let's see here. Ooh, got missing oh. locked on, dodge that, but then. See, there are like power ups or things to collect. All sorts of power ups. So here I just grabbed some multi missiles, took down uh -huh. Dusty. And the targeting Please. system is auto, auto lock? Auto lock, yeah. very simple. Right there. Oh. And how many different and levels are there? Uh, we've got a, a dozen different environments. Mm -hmm. Here's a favorite power up. Ooh, Except I got taken down. That's what I get for putting it on hard mode. Here. <laughs> Wait, what kind of different power ups? Like we saw the. Right, so I'm going to grab here. This is my favorite. This is Dr. F's laser. If you're familiar with my sins, you know Dr. F's sort of the mad scientist. Yeah. And here we've got this giant green <laughs> laser that arcs all across the level here. Oh, wow. That's almost not even fair. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got to hit people with it first. Well, okay, so this is like a free-for-all kind of deal. So when you're playing through the missions, is it also like a similar gameplay? You're kind of... So the, the main mission types tend to take uh, the form of dogfights or races. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, races, okay. Checkpoint type system, so races. Uh, but we also have uh, each chapter, we've got five different chapters, has uh, a boss objective-based battle. Mm -hmm. So those would be things like taking out generators or taking out uh, a special... Uh, boss character. All right, very cool. So I just got wasted right here. Right? <laughs> uh, this is my Sims kind of news. All right, great. So when does it come out and on what platform? It comes out on September 28th, mm -hmm. and it's going to be out on the 360, the PS3, the Wii, and the NDS. All right, well, thank you so much for coming by. Great. Thanks for having me. Yeah, that was our look at My Sims Sky Heroes, now on with the show.